Hi crafty friends, this is Ginger Pana. I wanted to do a video share. It is May 3rd and it is Thursday, the first Thursday of the month. And I am part of a zine craze collaboration hosted by Tina from Tell Him Thank You here on YouTube. She is hosting a monthly zine collaboration in which myself and about eight or nine other ladies are participating in. I will link their information on the bottom. Um, I wanted to share with you this month's zine that I created. I had to think about a lot of... I had to think about... Um, what theme did I want to do for me? And May, first I was going to do May Day. And in Hawaii, which is where I'm from, we celebrate May Day with all the flowers of the islands. And we, the schools have May Day programs where the children sing. Uh, we give a lot of flower lays. There's a big parade. There's even a princess court that represents each island. And so it's a kind of a big celebration in the islands. Also, May is Mother's Day. And I wanted to celebrate, you know, myself being a mother and all the other mothers out there. And then I thought, okay, um, Mother's Day. It's about, you know, to celebrate mothers. And I wanted to do something that maybe made me happy. So here goes. So last month at the our, my local craft fair... I found this new designer, Kitty B Designs. I don't think she's there that new. And I found out that they have a website on the internet. And I think if you Google Kitty B Designs, you'll get their um, page on your computer. So she makes the most adorable. Look at these pandas. They are so cute. So I found, saw them at the local craft fair, first time. I purchased many of their stamp sets, or their individual stamps. I didn't see any die sets, dies that came with it. So I bought the stamps. I thought, oh, they're easy to cut out. So here is a panda with glasses and a drink. Here is a pineapple panda. A panda with mail, panda with a coffee cup, panda eating a watermelon. Hey, Tina, I know you love watermelons too. And I bought two elephants. The one sitting for it and the one sitting on the side. Okay, so I got those. And then I stamped them and I started to use my Copic markers and I colored them. And then I started to embellish them, and I cut them out. I fussy cut them all out. And so I thought I wanted to make a zine with it. And I wanted, the bears are, as you can see, they pretty much take up a lot of the, more than half of the, the length of this page. And so I wanted to do some scriptures or some God's words on the pages as well and so I pulled out some of my Gina Marie Bible quotes and my tailored expression quotes stamps I have several so I went through them all and I picked out um, words that would fit along with the pandas being on the page and I came up with this so let's go through this um, here is my cover of my zine so when you open up the zine, well, let's do that later. So the first one I did the panda with the mail. I put a bling flower here. I made some kind of Maggie Holmes sort of creation here with the um, like the flags, it's circles. And I kind of mimicked the background paper. And this is the Maggie Holmes collection, I believe. I just got it on a recent trip that I came home. And it has these banners, this fringed banners. So I kind of mimicked it and I made my own two fringe banners. I embellished a lot of the zine pages with enamel dots. And I got a lot of these dots from T um, 
Yeah, from Tina, from Crafty Bean. And so those are from her. I love them. They are really expensive here in Hawaii. Like a pack of enamel dots is like around $7. And so I really enjoy it when I am gifted with them and that I found some on my recent trip. And I stamped this saying, trust in the Lord with all your heart. And I put a bling heart on it. And this scripture, this um, saying is really meaningful to me this month. I've been at a lot of crossroads in my life, a lot of decisions to make. And so, yes, um, let's see, yesterday was Tuesday. I'm doing this video on Wednesday. It's going to post on Thursday. But my teachings in church yesterday was about trust, all about trusting in the Lord and how perfect. I had already made this scene and I thought, okay, I made this about trusting in the Lord. I listened to a teaching, a ser my sermon last night at church was about trusting in the Lord and God is telling me to trust in him and everything will be okay, that he will show me the way. So this is my zine cover. So when you open the page, I kind of matched it up. So this is like fruits. And I was going to kind of do fruit of the spirit, but I found some other stamps that I could use. So here I have more enamel dots. I have a sticker. And I colored her up. And I don't know if you can see, but I did a lot of glittering on the black. I have a pineapple washi tape in the back. And this one says... What if you woke up today with only the things you thanked God for yesterday? So it made me think, you know, I re we really have to thank God every day for everything that we have each day. And the abundance of thankfulness that we have of all the things that we have. Okay. And this one is the watermelon panda. Look at that. He's eating and he has watermelon all over his face. Here is a watermelon sticker. And I have watermelon washi back here. And it says, thank you, God, for blessing me much more than I deserve. And it's true. You know, he has gifted me so much. I'm so grateful for everything that I have. And it's really more than I deserve. So I thank him. This center part of the zine is the elephant's. And so, so cute. So I put a bumblebee puffy sticker on his nose. And this one just has a bowl. So this page, I have some flower washi tape, which kind of copies the left and the right side. This one says, all it takes is just one prayer to change everything. How true. All we have to do is talk to him. And he will listen and he will answer. When life gives you more than you can stand, kneel, pray. So this was just perfect. The elephant is kneeling. Okay. This one is my last two pages. And it's the panda holding a drink and a coffee cup. And so I just put an enamel dot here. I put a heart bling here. I found a glasses enamel dot i guess this is an enamel sticker so i put it on her face it fit perfectly put an enamel dot on her flower and in her hair and this one says faith does not make things easy it makes them possible amen this one peace is not the absence of trouble but the presence of christ how very true so when I picked all these stamps, they really have a true meaning to me. And for each of us who follow his word, his word means so much to each one of us in different ways. And that's the most glorious part of it all. So my back cover says, No God, Love God. So I have, I have this panda here. Now I didn't have a stamp. I was going to repeat the stamp here, back here. But they also sell digital, so I bought a digital, I printed it, I colored it, and I cut it out. And of course, on all my zines on the back cover, I put my information and the day, the date of this zine, which is May 3rd, 2018. Okay, so when you open it up, 
Let's see. Oh. So it looks like this. So this one came out really pretty. I really like the colors in this one. And it's Xerox very well. The only thing is, you know, you I always learn on each of my zines. So the dimensional, I guess wherever the dots were, it kind of made the copy a little bit. You could tell if you look really closely, like a little bit blurry. But I think it's because of the dimensional that I put on it. But it's okay. And so I made copies out of on my printer. And then I printed it. And so this is the copy. So I'm going to send this out to you, Tina, and to some of my other crafty friends. Okay, so thank you so much for joining me on my zine journey. I appreciate all of you. I thank God that I have you as my, you know, that you support me, that you watch me, that you comment. I really enjoy it, and I'm so thankful I have all of you. So until our next month scene please check the other ladies out they're a wonderful group um, subscribe to them and follow them they make wonderful things and thank you tina from tell them thank you for hosting this scene that we're going to do every first thursday of the month until the end of the year take care everyone see you later bye